video on YouTube. I am Vyas Rao with you hosting this video and in this video I am going to tell you how to recover the condensate water that is continuously drained out through your domestic air conditioner units. Most of you may be having air conditioner units installed at your homes and some of you may be having it installed at your offices or establishments or at shops too. Ever since the air conditioner units are installed at your places, the condensate water discharged through them might be drained out and wasted. Here is a way which I am going to tell you in this video about how to recover the condensate water so that it can be utilized effectively. Otherwise, the same will go wasted. It is simple as well as affordable too for implementation. So stay tuned and continue to watch this video till its end. This is a high wall type mini split air conditioner unit installed in my home. Its cooling capacity is 1 ton which is quite enough to cool my bedroom. This is the indoor unit and next to this indoor unit you can see the pipe work. The pipe work is wrapped up with thermal insulation material to prevent the cooling losses. The pipe work includes refrigerant pipes and a drain pipe. The refrigerant pipes establish a connection between the indoor unit and the outdoor unit. The drain pipe carries away condensate water released from the indoor unit. Here is a power point provided to feed power to the air conditioner unit. The complete pipe work is terminated to outside. Here is the outdoor unit installed outside the bedroom. At present, the window in my bedroom is closed. You can very well see here. Let me open this window. Now you can see the outside view. Here is the drain pipe laid in such a way that instead of directing the condensate water to the drain point, it is directed to the bucket. Ample care is taken while laying the drain pipe to ensure that it is sloped properly so that back cycling of water through the indoor unit can be prevented. Here you can see the condensate water is being collected drop by drop in this bucket. The capacity of this bucket is 20 liters and it takes only 12 hours or sometimes even lesser than that to fill this bucket with condensate water. The water being collected appears to be clear but not very sure that it is clean and is in its purest form. But this collected condensate water can be utilized for cleaning the floors, washing your vehicles, and watering the plants, etc. By this way, we can contribute our share to conserve water in the present water crisis scenario. Here you can see the set temperature of my air conditioner unit is 27 degrees centigrade, which I usually prefer to operate during all the seasons from an energy savings perspective. If an air conditioner unit of one ton capacity operating at a set temperature of 27 degrees centigrade can release 20 liters of condensate water and sometimes 
even more within 12 hours then imagine how much amount of condensate water can be recovered from those air conditioner units which are over and above one ton capacity and operated for more than 12 hours per day as for the needs however the case considered in this video pertains to suburb regions of mumbai which is considered to be a humid place the amount of condensate water that can be recovered may vary with the geography set temperature cooling capacity of air conditioner unit ambient conditions and the operating hours however the easiest way to determine the recovery rate of condensate water is plotting the indoor conditions and the outdoor conditions of air on the psychrometric chart so guys if you have enjoyed watching this video then please click the like button appearing on your screen and if you wish to receive updates on the launching of my new videos then please do subscribe this channel on youtube